the first step to my science experiment is to uh, make so mix sodium acetate and boiled water together and make a solution and we're going to put as much sodium acetate in until it can't hold anymore and that makes it, makes it saturated. It's done on the stove because it's fully saturated and it can't hold anymore. So now we're going to pour it into these small cups and let it cool on the let them cool on the counter. Nothing can disturb. I'm going to touch the super saturated sodium acetate solution and it'll turn from solid to a, from a liquid to a solid. Uh, all I need to do is put some sodium acetate in. And now I'll touch this one. I put a little clump in and that started to grow. Oh, this one's going too. It just got disturbed. By air. Oh, yep. And look what happened to our picture. Oh, no. <laughs> Uh-oh, the big one. And we know. There they all are. See that they're solid because um, it's not coming out. Well, this is what will happen if you start pouring it. it it'll tower up on it. So. Keep pouring. Keep going. Keep going. Pour it in the middle. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> and it's clogged. <laughs> what? What happened? It clogged. Why is it clogged? Cause, oh my, I <laughs> didn't have the chance to do it. It turned to solid while you were pouring. Now I'm going to uh, pour this. Uh, um, super saturated sodium solution, and uh, it'll crystallize when it hits the counter. And it's burning. Going to make use another cup and pour it, make it higher. And now we're going to add two more. As you can see, it's all solid now and burning hot. That's why it's called hot ice. Um, you we put it, all the crystallized sodium acetate into the pan again, and we're gonna heat it up so it'll turn back into a liquid.